All right, um, this is the Great All 544 D10, uh, 55 foot maximum uh, lift height, tens for the 10,000 pounds. Uh, this machine is, uh, is is pretty unique in the in the telehammer world, uh, just mostly because of its rear steering, and I want to spend some time talking about what are some of the advantages of rear pivot steering versus uh, other styles of machines. Um, the rear pivot steering uh, is really designed to minimize the movement of the load uh, when you have a, a congested job site. A lot of times the load sticks out beyond the width of the machine. And that comes in handy um, when you're looking at your turning radius. And, and a lot of us measure turning radius of the machine. It's really what's the turning radius of the entire machine with the load. And with rear pivot steering, in 99% of the cases, your outside turning radius of the machine made stays as your outside turning radius, even if you have a wide load of lumber, a steel beam, a truss, what have you. Um, and it will actually pivot around its, uh, its opposite front tire. And if that's the case, your outside turning radius is really your back tire. So it's got a very uh, competitive flow chart. Um, the, the maneuverability is, is its most identifiable features, but a couple of the other features that it has, it's a, uh, a hydrostatic transmission, uh, so it, it doesn't have power shift, which allows very easy operation. Another advantage to that is just a very smooth operating machine, so the ability to place loads at height um, without having to you know, get used to the power shift, you can just feather in and, and, and control the boom very well with a smooth, smooth uh, control system that it has. Um, another advantage to the rear pivot steering when it comes to placing a load, um, what's what I call a poor man's uh, side shift carriage, is if you're just a little bit off at full height and you need to finish up your, your load with rear pivot steering, you can actually move your um, forks uh, side to side to get that final 6, 12, 18 inches of adjustment to line the load up with the destination. Um, another feature that works in conjunction with that is called inching, and uh, again, this is for final placement of a load. It's not meant for driving with the boom elevated, but for final placement, this machine allows for a lot of versatility, and that's why a lot of these uh, trades really prefer uh, the rear pivot steer. It's another advantage of it besides job site maneuverability. Yep. Starting at the front, again, we have the uh, frame-mounted uh, outriggers. Um, the front, again, doesn't steer, so that um, adds some simplicity to the machine. Uh, the axles are Carrero. The uh, power plant is a uh, John Deere 125 horsepower. Um, it's a pretty uh, pretty straightforward cab. One of the features that, uh, that Great All offers on these machines is a uh, left-hand tilt and uh, sway, and allows the operator to uh, more comfortably operate the different features. Uh, uh, quite a few of the dreidels are actually specified this way, however the standard configuration is for everything on the right hand, but it's one of the more popular options on the dreidel, especially on the west coast. Uh, the dreidel features what we call a mid-mount engine. It's not really side mounted, it's not really rear mounted, it's kind of mounted towards the central frame of the machine. Again, it's an advantageous position for visibility. Coupled with the high boom pivot, um, in a normal carrying position, you can see underneath the boom and have good visibility out the rear of the machine. Um, it's got good access for all the service points. Uh, the Gradle also uh, offers a rear axle stabilization system. At uh, 45 degrees, the hydraulic fluid is, is, is reduced, so it has a kind of a dampening effect. Uh, so it's, not a, it's not a straight lock, but it's a, it's a dampened rear axle at 45 degrees. There are several tire options available on the Great Hall. The standard configuration is uh, calcium filled, and uh, there are uh, rock tires and other uh, versions available. That, that's uh, most everything that uh, sets her apart as a different machine.